I know I have a reputation for starting every recipe with a pound of butter, but this one's actually a lemon cake that's made with yogurt and vegetable oil, so it's, it's even good for you, and it's delicious. So I'm gonna start with the dry ingredients, one and a half cups of flour, two teaspoons of baking powder, and a half a teaspoon of salt. Just sift those together. Okay, I need one cup of yogurt. I use whole milk yogurt. I think it is. Gives a good flavor. Okay, one cup of sugar. You can make it without butter, but not without sugar. Okay, three extra large eggs. I always use room temperature eggs when I'm baking. Really makes the cakes lighter. Half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Two teaspoons of lemon zest. That's actually about the zest of one lemon. Just right into the bowl. This is what gives it all its flavor. I actually think the zest has more flavor than the juice, so whenever I make something with lemon, I always put the zest in. Mm, smells good already. And then later, I'm gonna use the juice and make a syrup, a lemon syrup for it. That's about two teaspoons. Okay, I'm just gonna whisk it all together. Okay, I'm just gonna take the dry ingredients, whisk them in. I'm just gonna toss them with my hand, make sure they're well mixed, and just slowly whisk them in. The next thing I need is a half a cup of vegetable oil. It's a flavorless oil. Just stir it in. I've greased and floured a loaf pan. Just pour this right in. That was a pretty easy cake, wasn't it? So the lemon yogurt cake is out of the oven, and while it cools, I'm gonna make a lemon syrup. Just pour over it, make it even better. So I need a third of a cup of lemon juice. I'm just gonna heat it up with a third of a cup of sugar. I'm just gonna let that come to a boil until it becomes just very clear. Okay, this is perfect. Sugar's dissolved. And I'm just gonna spoon it right over the cake. And then what it does is it just soaks right into the cake, keeps it really moist, and has lots of great lemon flavor.